Well, we needed in a lot of ways. Now, first of all, we had to get back in the win column, and second, we had to break the bats out. That it was, I mean, I mean, that was really important to uh, put some big hits up. You know, the home runs, the you know, just to really break out of it. Hopefully, that we get a little bit more consistency with you know, with on the offensive side. Can a night like tonight mean more than just the one win? Can it change the feel of a room and get guys going? Well, we hope so. That's kind of you know, we, um, you know, they're. Guys have been talking. Hey, look, you know, even the beginning of the, you know, the, before the meeting yesterday, before the game was, hey, look, you know, we've we've had a tough week. Let's, you know, we got to keep playing hard. And uh, tonight was a, a good night for us to lift our, get our spirits back. That's for sure. When after you uh, make the lineup and you put Flores ninth and Degrom eighth and they respond <laughs> with Flores hitting a grand slam and Degrom getting three hits, do you feel like? You're touching something right today. Well, <laughs> he did something right. That's for sure. That, you know, I, uh, again, I, I know the, you know we all know Wormer's got some power, but it's uh, I'm just hoping that when he starts swinging the bat like he's capable of, he's going to get on base and and you know hopefully top of the lineup you know drives drives some runs in. But tonight, uh, big huge night for Jake. I mean, he's he's had a tough couple games and. Tonight it was a good game for him to go out and pitch well, and then of course really swing the bat great too. Surprised uh, when you get three hits like that? Yeah, I'm, you know, he t yeah, I mean, he's a pretty good hitter for a pitcher, but uh, you know, he uh, uh, the, the first one I thought was really a key. You know, uh, they they were had a play on defensive play on, and you know, he got a base hit and drove a run in. I thought that was a you know a real big big hit for him and for us. How, how great was it to see the way Kevin uh, Pawecki played tonight after obviously he had the uh, Physical issues yesterday. Yeah, I mean, he played very good, and that's why I said he, you know, he, late in the game yesterday, he thought he said, "Look, if you really need me, I can play." And, and I, I just said, "I'm not taking a chance tonight with the dizzy stuff." But he came back today and uh, played well, and hopefully he took that one off the mask. I'll see how he is in the morning, but uh, you know, the foul tip. So hopefully it doesn't stir, stir something else. Wilmer's now tied for with all major league shortstops and home runs, and his defensive struggles aside, is that something you can like pinpoint at him? And have a concrete base for his confidence, maybe say like, this is what you're doing now, and that's make you look to your performing co as confidently as you can. Well, I, I mean, it's got to help him. It's got to help him. He, you know, all the decisions were a lot of them were wrapped around the fact we all think he's going to hit and he's gonna, he's going to put up big offensive numbers. And um, you know, he's with the defensive side. I think he's really been pressing at the plate a little bit to try to do something. And tonight, I hope really got his, get, helps his confidence and. Um, you know, gets him going. You know, we're gonna, you know, there's gonna be again. We're gonna, there's gonna be another night where he's gonna make an error. That's just part of the game. But um, you know, if he gets swinging the bat, we're gonna like we're gonna like some of the results. Terry, what you guys have been going through. What's the dugout like when that ball goes out that Flores hits in that inning? And what's it like the rest of that inning when well, they just keep was, on getting the hits? Of course, there was a couple of where's this been from down the bench <laughs> and. Uh, but you know, again, it, it was a good night for us that because we needed we needed to have a good game where we scored some runs and not not just three where we went out and, and drove some runs in and the home runs helped. But uh, I, I thought there were some really really good swings tonight. I just want to make sure I understand you with regards to Wilmer. You think he had been pressing at the plate, or did you think well, I he think, had been pressing in the field? Because no, I, I think when you you know when you struggle when you're when you're out there and you're supposed to hit everybody we you know and you're not. Hitting and now you have a, a, maybe a couple of rough defensive games. You really say, "God, I got to start hitting. I got to start hitting." Um, and, and I did. I'm, I'm answering a question that I have no idea what's in his mind. I just know what a lot of a lot of guys would go through. That look, I've got. I really have to start hitting. And you know, sometimes you, you you get a little over over anxious and swing at some bad pitches. And tonight, you know, he showed what what he's capable of doing, and that's have a big night offensively. Just getting back to Jake at the plate. How much does it help? You have a guy like him who can handle the bat. We had two, a lot of times, sacrifice situations. You allowed him to hit away. I mean, what kind of a, an advantage is that to have something It's like huge. That? It's huge. We, you know, JP, we talk about it every spring. We talk to the pitchers every spring about, you know what, doing little things. Number one, handle the bat. I'm not saying get a lot of hits, but, you know, put the ball in play. Move runners along. Be able to bunt. Uh, you know, the play 
you know, that he made on the, uh, the ball coming back, to, or that Eric Goodell made on the ball coming back to the mound. I mean, those things help you win games. You know, when you can field your position and you can handle a bat, do, do some little things. I mean, you win, you can help win yourself some games. Yeah. Terry, have you uh, been a part of anything like that on that side of it at this level, or is this something you last saw maybe in the PCL or something? 14 r runs? Uh, uh, ten, ten run inning, ten run inning. I, mean. uh, I, I, don't, I don't think I've ever, I don't think I've been a part of one in the big leagues, no. Jacob and Wilmer are kind of going to headline the story here tonight, but how important was it for Michael to do what he did as well? Yeah, I mean, we, it was, it's what I'm saying. It was just a good night for us. We had some guys hit the ball good. Michael hit the ball good. Uh, you know, Dan, had, Dan swung the bat better. The middle, when that middle of that lineup starts to hit like we think they're going to hit, I mean, we're going to score runs. Uh, we've gone through a bad stretch where they haven't hit, and they, they're the ones that they certainly talk about it. And, uh, it's not from lack of getting prepared or anything else. It's just it's one of the parts of the game that you don't, you don't like to go through, but every team does. What did you see from Jacob on the mound tonight? Obviously, coming off of a rough start, do you see adjustments and improvement? Well, you, you know, you saw tonight when he's down in the zone that he gets he gets outs, and then when he goes, and it, again, even some of the strikeouts, balls down, balls down, and then all of a sudden he comes up here, changes eye levels, and he gets strikeouts. That's what he did all last summer that made him successful. He has had a tough time finding the sinker to, to be consistent. And even there were times tonight where you saw a lot of a lot of fastballs up, and that's not him. You know, he's usually pitching down when that. So the, the thing they've been working on is to find the two seamer that, you know, he gets the ground balls with. And then because he's got a good enough arm that, you know, if you get them looking down and you can change change the, what they're looking at once in a while and throw a four seam fastball up, you're going to strike some people out. And that's what he did tonight. Any, any other? Watch. Terry, uh, as far as. Well, yeah, I mean, that's what you got to do to win games. You got to make plays. And we talk about the little things. We all, you know, we've been preaching it. Hey, we got to go out there and grind out at bats. We, we had some of that tonight. We got to go out there and we play, play the game right. We did that. Great play by Eric on that, keeping that ball from going in the corner. All right, didn't get anybody out. They didn't score any runs either. Um, and those are the those are what you got to do. And yeah, there's going to be nights you're going to get beat. They're just going to the other team's going to come out and beat you. But you know we have we just have not been swinging the bats. We had a chance to, you know, you look at the Chicago series. We had a chance to win every game, but we just haven't hit. And tonight was a you know hopefully we got we got it going. 